Hey, we're fascinating world chemistry. We're looking at colloids. Colloids are defined as, let's shorten this up a little bit. Okay. Substances that with particles that are invisible to the naked eye are too large to be considered homogeneous. All right. So, some examples jello, fog, marshmallow, soap, smoke, all of those are colloids. Now, how do we identify a colloid? The process is called the Tyndall effect. My son always loved this when he was a kid. Adam would take his flashlight around the campfire, flash the light to the smoke, and he would become a Jedi fighting for the, the, the side of light. That's the Tyndall. That little beam you see in the middle of any kind of a colloid is how we identify it. All right, now, types of colloids. We either have hydrophobic, or hydrophilic. Now, you should know from biology probably, hydrophobic means water hating. So in other words, it, it doesn't dissolve or react well with water. Hydrophilic is water loving. It does react well with water. Okay, so now some key terms here. We have a dispersing and a disperse. Dispersing is a solvent, well, acts like the solvent. Dispersed is a solid. All right, so this huge list here, I'm not gonna make you know all of this. The only thing I'm really going to ask you to know are these names right here. So a aerosol is a, so almost all, you have to know what an, an aerosol is. It's in a gas phase, gas dispersing, gas dis, liquid dispersed. So go through, you have to study those. I'm sorry, nothing I can do about it. That's just where it's at. Now, the only last thing we have to talk about here is the process of remo removing dispersing material, okay? Because it can't be filtered. I just can't, really can't get it out of there. So what do I do? There's two different ways I can work with it. Either First is called coagulation. What I do with coagulation is the process of enlarging the dispersion can be later filtered away. We do this by heating or an electrolyte, which achieves this process, okay? So if I heat it up, or add an electrolyte, it'll cause it almost like clot up, and then I can take it away. The other th process I can do is called dialysis, like we do in blood. Run the color through a semi-permeable membrane, and that allows us to filter through. That's it. Take care. We are done. Be good. Bye.